brighter future. So let me say no to this. afternoon on a good morning depending on usa you day where you they watch we from usa you they watch we now the wall um i hope say you had a lovely week i hope say life wasn't so hectic so challenging and if even if it was, I hope say you see opportunities in the hardship or in the difficulties for forge ahead. Um, once again, I want to tell you now, Boku Boku, thank you. On our they watch we from all with different platforms, them all over the world. <coughs> we do not take it for granted. As we did sit on Ayaso every Saturday, every Thursday, every Sunday, forgive you the best of us as we discuss issues affecting or finding solutions to issues affecting, you know, um, our motherland, Sierra Leone. We um, definitely appreciate you all taking the time to join in for putting my own two cents you know for putting my own two cents um for make you know we we weave a, a very good basket right so last week i not been there so i want to tell um mr cargo and um mr jambo yaboku thank you where they all two, um, you know, sit down for me inside the show and, you know, had a, a very fantastic dis discussion. Um, I was busy 
Um, I know I can wear many hats then and uh, last week was one of um, you know the hats then why they wear away I know they trade not the world for anything nothing um, stops me from attending that event from being at that event and when I say nothing I have to be like debilitatingly sick for me not for grab because stem down the way I even know they feel well I'll grab a wear clothes I go to that event day and do what I need to do and that is raising awareness and raising money for um, the Kidney Foundation of Ottawa and a team where they volunteer all year round for. I've been doing it for over 10 years now and I find great satisfaction in giving back to the community, giving back to the society in this way. So in a teen way, I know they, I know they joke with at all. So when I look at the calendar, I look at the dates and everything, I just call Mr. Kagbo say, Oh yeah, <laughs> I have to OT <laughs> I'm not going to be here. So and he was gracious and Mr. Jamboya, um, I believe he pulled Mr. Jamboya, both of them were gracious to take over the show. Um so basically this is I guess my own call for telling I say if you are in a community and you know you wanna be involved in, in a good cause, good charity, something where they give back, you know. A lot of people and they suffer from kidney disease, various form of kidney disease, right? And um na salon, I think we get um now few places then where they do dialysis. But because we know how we can't see day and how expensive things are, it is hard the money for do dialysis, for sustain the person where they, you know, they suffer from the kidney, the, the kidney disease, right? The renal failure is it, very difficult. Um, luckily, we then at Empathias of the world where um, medical is not that bad. You know, sometimes you might have to shave money out of your pocket, but you thank God for insurance. If you get a good insurance coverage, you get a place where you get a good healthcare system. Um, you they take care of yourself properly. It means that, you know, you go able to prolong your life. And luckily, maybe you have a donor we depending on the stages, say if you didn't have the final and at the end stage renal failure, definitely you need a new kidney. Without a new kidney, you can't survive. Unless I also be, believe in the power of creative, uh, of restorative miracle, right? Unless some form of miracle happen and your kidneys are restored back to normal. Outside of that, you need a um, kidney transplant because you can only do dialysis for so long. Either you are doing peritoneal dialysis or hemodialysis, um, you know, you can only do it for so long for clean out your blood, wash out um, the system and all of that. Um, I know for say we salon people them, <clears throat> especially I'm talking to Sierra Leoneans right now, then see so we know they take us seriously at all. We know they take us seriously. We don't even want to pay attention to these things. Pay attention to our health, know our family history, no waiting we for try for prevent. But then I seen them where we we supposed to pay attention to because it is part of our lives. You may never know when you would have, you know, a loved one where you go confront these type of things. I have had a cousin where obviously multiple complications, that's not the only thing, but because as a result of what it happened in order to in them, eventually it led, it led to, you know, the kidney failing. And, you know, he had to be going for um, dialysis and the money involved. If you not get her like that, trust me, you go perish very quickly. You perish very quickly, right? Um, so not in them way, we need for bring awareness now with society. We need for bring awareness now with community. How can we avoid? How can we prevent? Mind you, some of these things are not avoidable or preventable. 
sometimes um, you know they are hereditary then at the family line sometimes they are not you just happen to be that person that you know because of whatever you catch it you get it how do you what do you do to survive what do you go do for survive what do you go do for thrive and get a full functioning life we get for talk about them here so you know <clears throat> i know of a doctor obviously one of the people them um dr um fuad sheif um we recently as a matter of fact do a medical mission at sierra leone um when i have the full um summary of that mission i'll definitely talk about what 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 happened at that time during that mission in sierra leone they pretty much go almost all over the all over sierra leone for rwanda medical mission day the need was so much they could not attend to all of the people who showed up at all of the different places because the need is so much the need is so much um i like for future then see as soon i'm a show because I know that people don't talk about these things, but for me, these things are important. We talk about salon issues, it's not just about the politics, right? It's not just about the economy. It's not, but it's, it's, it's inclusive of every other thing. That's what makes up salon issues. That's what makes up Sierra Leone, right? So from time to time, when I go here, meet it. When I go there, hear you, and they talk about different, different things them. Um, as I am involved, as I am part, I know they talk about Tinway, I know involved, I know they part of, I know will get the language for speak about, at least to the, to the little knowledge we may Sabi, right? Um, breast cancer is another thing. I know like the Clear Descendant Union of um, Southern Ontario, and they sponsor a clinic, na, 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 salon right now where they provide medication to people them way diagnosed of breast with breast cancer. Right, that's another thing we need to talk about, how for self-examine and early warning sign. Unfortunately, I do not know if Sierra Leone has a mammogram, um, you know, machine. I don't know if they, they do mammogram na salon, I no go lie. And if they, they do mammogram na salon, please viewers, I go like for make unu tell we say yes place then a salon where then they do mammogram because now um um where then they do mammogram before the age for make you start for begin do mammogram um na 50 but because of how much and how widespread and how you know the amount the volume and then don't study them over time now they advise at the age of 40 and don't bring the thing at the age of 40 you can start doing your mammogram early detection is always better right early detection is always better because it gives you a fighting chance for live and live a very healthy and long life so mr Sefwe Sidon Ayaso, i therefore can book my mammogram very soon um you know for make a a a do my mammogram because now i don't have to wait until i'm 50 i am within the age 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 range now where i qualify for get a mammogram done right and because me young 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 family um you know there's a history of breast cancer and me young family right um within my family um the doctors then can always say if your mama and your papa not get time then you are good no 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 <laughs> i don't go with that spiel if me auntie or me granny or somebody been get it still within the same bloodline for me so for me prevention is better than cure so just because of me mama and my papa not get time when i'm a direct direct dna bloodline no me for say i'm going to be lax about it and can't see them about i know i'll go further and check and make sure say I am good. Another thing is your pap smear. And go say why make Batilda, why make you they talk all them things as on a thing the way they affect women? And I will tell you the reason why I'm talking about all of these things. Don't forget to do your pap smear. Don't forget to do your regular pap smear. It's very, very important for the woman them, right? And for the man them, let me throw in this. Don't forget to do your prostate. Please don't forget to do your prostate. Do your prostate check, your prostate examination. 
when that time come, when you don't reach that age, they man them on an like for go hospital on an like or see doctor. But a lot of men, especially black men, are dying of prostate cancer, are being diagnosed with prostate cancer. So please do the needful, making an all left in a family them, you know, just like that, when you could have prevented these things. Medicine has advanced, medicine has come a long way. Reason why I took the time to say all of this, I know say I begin with me volunteering work and why I was absent. When I know for say there's always a logic to my madness. All just to say happy International Women's Day. <laughs> All just to say happy International Women's Day. International Women's Day was yesterday. Um, a lot of celebrations them take place. Miss FSF be engaging quite a number of them yesterday, you know, and even before. And there's going to be a lot more events that are going to be taking place. And um, the theme for this year is inspire inclusion, inspire inclusion. And more specifically, this is what, what it reads. More specifically, it says, let's inspire inclusion to help forge a better, more inclusive world for women. For women. Let's inspire inclusion to foster more inclusive world for women. What does that mean to you? inspire inclusion when you hear the word inspire inclusion how do you inspire inclusion in what area have you aspired to inspire inclusion right now let me take the opportunity for say next week saturday show i could bring a panelist of women nayaswe and say talk about what inspire inclusion for women means to you that for me is boring because you will give me a number of spill a number of blab what i will what i'll go rather is that if you are a self-made person you started from the ground up and now you are here you survived the covid or even after covid you launch something where you know say don't pick up where you know for say they do good they thrive please contact viewers Contact VOS, I go want to forget you in a panel next week, Saturday. Make we talk about what inspired you and how you are going to inspire others so that it can be a better place for women. That's what I'm thinking. That's what I want to do in this you know, month of March that's celebrating women right that celebrating women that's what i would like to do to have a panelist a panel discussion on not only futuring what you waiting you they do what you do accomplish how you start you know the the hurdles the 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 hurdles the way you face the challenges them and how you surmount them challenges them day and how you continue and how you continue for build on but more importantly what does this this year's 2024 theme of you know inspire hashtag inspire inclusion what does it mean to you in that thing that you are doing that that for me is is a much more of an interesting discussion than what does you know inspire inclusion for a better place for women means to you in general right so i want to reach out to our community Right, they say charity begins at home. I want to reach out to the Sierra Leone community. If you know, say you know that person, they reach out to VOS. Please reach out to VOS. Let's have a wholesome um, 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 discussion. Once again, happy International Women's Day. And I cannot stop talking about International Women's Day without an say government. The government of Sierra Leone are still the wait for a verdict on the conclusion of the UNA tribunal UNA set for the Auditor General and in, in, in deputy. Right? I'm talking about uh, Madame Lara Taylor Pierce here. So, right now, UNA don't December, January don't pass, February don't pass. Now, inside March, we did so. So, we are entering the third month 
following the conclusion of this whole thing. I don't think a deliberation should take that long. I don't think doing the right thing towards a woman would take that long. I don't think you would grace international platforms talk about what you are doing when most of the time, if we go and go look at the evidence, the results are not there. How about you prove yourself with an evidence that we can see the results of? Do the right thing. You know what the right thing is. I don't know if Nadraya Koba shame now, now, I don't depend. But listen, the nation will forgive you. They would look past, so long as they know at least the right person is there to do the job. Yeah? Now, with that said, I want to transition to something where, when I know for say for many, 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 many months, even before the elections when i begin me show at the beginning i stop playing my own personal introductory music and i begin um play the squish kush 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 because they don't become a men menaces now with society they don't become a terror <coughs> destroyer of life excuse me destroyer of future right so me make a my own personal mission. And obviously, you know, for say I deal with hope for you, Sierra Leone. And I know go deal with an organization. And then they do such a wonderful job. And I have a platform. And I choose for, you know, not project the work way than they do. Not go be. But that was my own way of amplifying the work that these great young people are doing all over Sierra Leone. But you see, in as much as I don't, they pull this, some people, them, I remember they say, Matilda, why make always now this squish music? You not get any other music for play. No, 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 because there is a crisis. Until that crisis is handled and dealt with, is put under control or completely eradicated. No, I have no option but for keep promoting the message. For keep amplifying the message that this is an emergency, this is an urgency. And the more we ignore them, the more we get into deeper trouble. So now, whether be it the fact that the leaf way that they take make kush, we all know that it is coming from the mountains of Afghanistan. It is very well known that now they that leaf day they grow as a matter of fact. But guess what? Sierra Leone is now making news that they are the suppliers and maker of this very very nefarious drug so you see when something happens and you not take precaution you not handle them when there is a spark and you not handle them you allow them for blowing to a fire guess what happens what thing you they get now an inferno now an inferno Inferno no way means say for them people away no no waiting at inferno means in a big 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 fire like bushfire wildfire now you they get and you know for say bushfire wildfire you have for control so with a small spark with a small pill way see am now that make it fine for make you throw away water and cover them and autumn Make you not begin the spark, 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 spark. Because if it's spark, 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 you don't know where till they go grab. So now we are grabbing attention. And this is with our neighbors. Very soon we go grab international attention. I don't talk now, so say we know who are the parties and the perpetrators of this thing so importation into salon. We know that they are very highly placed. We know who are involved. We know say people that they come on America where they um, bring um, what's this thing called now? Um, <clears throat> I don't forget the drug name, but if I remember, I go call the name. We know say people and then America where they travel, where they where, where they import. We know say people and then a UK where they import. I wish it could come off the top of my head for me to call it. Because
Because at one particular point, even Canada and Iaso self they face a crisis of one of them drug that day. Where people I mean just they collapse and sleep, they die, they die, they die, they die. Especially, especially a minority and disadvantaged group, the Aboriginal people, the First Nations people. In areas where they are concentrated, more concentrated, and they have, you know, the reserves them. Places like Vancouver, places like Manitoba, right? Places like Nunavut, right? I can go on and on and on and on. It became a national crisis. Who been get for the government being really seriously get for put a lot of resources for taper that thing day. Doesn't mean they successfully wipe it out, but the seriousness, they realize the gravity of what was going on. And I tell you now for say in certain things, not to the not to the population the lead. The government gets for take the head, it gets for take the lead. And that lead they now people then can come in and battle and put and behind government. For make the work go before but if the government does not seem to take the lead and abandon ship guess what in order for be good at all in order for be good you know they see when i youth them they nod in a tree when i don't see policeman inside uniform same thing when i don't see soldier man inside uniform same thing when i don't see nurses them when I don't see doctors, the one way for treat the one way no well. Hmm? I mean, call the profession. When I don't see them, where that thing they don't affect. But that they enough, you know, do for me. We say this is a crisis that we need to tackle and tackle so immediately with expediency. Make me play a video. <clears throat> Make unsettling clear, events you. in recent months. This includes the tragic killing of a British woman, an armed robbery in Kian Keneba, an incident involving suspected possession of unlicensed firearms and illicit drugs-related offences. Cadet ASP Bintan Jaijata, the public relations officer of the Gambia Police Force, addresses the country's crime rate. Some of these criminal activities, suspected criminal activities that are reported, are um, staged. Like he said, the attack of the Bureau de Change. I am aware few have happened that are legitimate, but the others were all state. So there's no high rate of crime. It's just reported. Also, um, all these gun violence we have registered, we have apprehended, prosecuted, and convicted those people. Bakari Gassama, Director General of the Drug Law Enforcement Agency, the Gambia D League delved into the prevalence of the drug Kush in the country, shedding light on its origins and usage trends among the youth. Kush started prevailing in our society last year in 2023. The first case we registered was in March. Then the second case was registered in May. Then from June, we started registering more cases up to now. We have a record seizure you know, on many nationalities. And most of the uh, traffickers, initially those who were venturing into this, many of them were Sierra Leonean nationals. This course is prevalent in Sierra Leone. We could say the origin is coming from Sierra Leone. You all know the havoc it is causing on the youth of uh, Sierra Leoneans. The use of Kush, often referred to as the zombie drug, has seen a worrying rise among young Gambians, leading to significant health and societal harms. Momodu T. Nyasi, Deputy Director of Health Services at the Ministry of Health, highlighted cases suspected to be linked to Kush and ongoing investigations. 25th of January to date, we have registered more than 25 cases and two brought in death in our, both our teaching hospital and other health facilities, all suspected to have consumed this substance known as Kus and some others call it Ginabas. We are still continuing on the investigation part of it by collecting samples to help us reach 
at a conclusion. But as so far, we cannot be sure and we cannot be 100% certain that the cause of death and all this problem is because of coups. We cannot say that. Siyaka Sonko, the Minister of Interior, stressed the importance of citizens' involvement in assisting law enforcement agencies, emphasizing that safeguarding the nation's security is a collective responsibility. Together, all of us, where the police are absent, you are a citizen, you have a right to have security. You see people behave in a particular way, take your mobile phone quietly. When you are safe, take a shot of the individual, share it with the police. The joint press briefing was called to ease security concerns and raise awareness, particularly among youth, about the serious threats posed by Kush to public health. The Ministry of Interior reaffirmed its commitment to ensuring the safety and security of all citizens, managing crisis effectively and upholding the rule of law in the Gambia. Okay, so on our own right? So now who that they accuse say then are the makers and suppliers and pushers of this kush. So it don't come on out from they bringing into the land to the land being accused of being the pioneer of, you know, another person's um, um, wahala. I want to take a minute, please, viewers and listeners, we did on several platforms then. If you get any information towards the topic what they talk about that is vital for sharing, please share it on the various platforms that you are watching me on. Do not send it to my personal contact. Do not try to call me while I am on live doing a live show. It is very distracting. If you not say I they live, then you they call me personal phone or they try for reach me on my personal phone. What do you expect? Do you expect me to stop what I am doing and answer your call and pick up your call? It is impossible. We the stream from so many platforms them where we get possibilities for interact and upload information and have a full discussion. Sending it to my personal phone is not going to help the general public. It's not going to help those watching and those interested in knowing more. If there are services available out there, you know, if there are treatment centers available out there, you sending me that information, I'm not going to stop what I'm doing to read what you're sending me. It is better for you to send it or um, display it or share it, you know, in, in the general um, platform. We get with numbers, then I also way you not can call. You not can call. As a matter of fact, let me call out the number. If you did North America, the North America toll free number now, one eight six six. 9447722 the UK local 9 are plus 442080891455 the Australia local um, number na plus 6129098437 the WhatsApp line na 9 um sorry 1 343-997-5828. So dear, we go to display the number then they do ya a big. When I call the number then they and if I get a contribution, I can call this number and I make a contribution. It serves no point. As a matter of fact, it defeats the purpose that you want to send me an information that I'm talking about on a topic that I'm currently discussing. I think the best and most, um, you know, um, you know, useful outcome would be to, to, if you are listening to me, it means, or watching me, it means you have access to this platform. I would urge you strongly to, to, to share those information and those platform because time and time again, while I listen to calls, the producer can they flash comments them 
and I see those and if there's a comment that is of interest definitely I'll pick it up and then I go re-amplify them within this platform yeah do you are big I don't want to be disrespectful or be dismissive but there are certain ethics that we need to abide by and I'm just saying what my ethics are so if you don't know now you know um so basically as we did, as I've been they say you know this thing here so like where they can say potopoto poto, don't catch fire potopoto poto, really really don't catch fire in this business we cannot ignore it anymore um no i'm not referring to trauma doll there is another narcotic that i'm referring to i'm not referring to trauma doll there's another narcotic i'm referring to if i um, come across um, and it's not heroin either um even though heroin now something back with them the less in part of them and heroin is very also very 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 um, um dangerous very dangerous but i go find the name and when i find the name i go put them up um for sure um um yes i agree with you that if kush is in in the gambia it means it is in in guinea and liberia as well i absolutely agree with you because then three places then the way you mentioned as a matter of fact they are heavily trafficked by sierra union when I say heavily trafficked, I don't mean traffic. I mean, you know, the frequency, the travel back and forth by Sierra Leone. And now, if the Gambia is pointing to Sierra Leone, remember that we don't get the squish problem for years and years. And they are saying the first surface of it that they are aware of as a government institution was March of 2023. And that now they defend people and they die I think one or two people that we don't die of overdose, overdose age, right? Right? Um, on, on this drug, and they they are taking step for make sure say in all can rampant, in all can take over. Now then country like how it don't take over na salon. Sometimes when then things also happen, we play around. We they take a like joke. We make fun about it, you know. We laugh about it. But this is an entire generation that's been wasted. Wasted. Like for me, honestly, I they ask, what is the motive behind this? That a government, and again, this not you know begin from um. It not begin from this current government, the young rulership. It begin from the past governments, the rulership. And before, their, theirs was Pampas, right? Theirs was Pampas, Pampas. But basically, not the same effect. Now, the degree of the internal damage is what we are yet to ascertain. As in, the level of the degree of the internal damage of these two drugs are they similar do they produce similar internal damages or is one more potent than the other you know i'm not i do not have a medical background so therefore i cannot speak to this with 100 percent certainty and authority yeah but at least i can talk Talk about, about um, from the understanding of a layman. And this is where I'm coming from. Right? Waiting, then see as so they do now, then with people, now, then people, then body, the chemical makeup in composition. Waiting at the after effect to their organs, then, then composition. Their, their brain and their fun the functioning of their internal system you cannot have a health ministry where inside the health system people are falling victim to this thing and then we sit down they play botskidi we sit down they play tic tac toe do you want to gamble with the life of an entire generation 
Is that the aim here? Just so you can get away with whatever agenda you have. Because you will have a generation that is mute, incapable of thinking, incapable of functioning. And so therefore, you have your way with your way. Is that the plan here? Because I don't understand anymore. I'm getting really frustrated about this situation because I don't see any serious push. Serious, serious push, like a nationwide push for put a stop to this, a nationwide plan that takes no prisoners and that say, no, 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 no. Listen, our generation is at risk here. Our future is in jeopardy. So maybe something I'm new, maybe I care too much. Or maybe there is an agenda or plan that I'm not aware about, and that maybe some of us are not aware about. And that's not that makes so maybe some of we the force. And basically, if some of we the force, some of we the try for push, then obviously, if we are not aware of the overarching plan, Or maybe if we are made aware of it, certainly we will not be in agreement of that plan. So therefore, it is better for it to be kept amongst the cabal. For them to perfectly execute. But at whose detriment? Now we don't go international. Because the moment when you cross border, international you go not a local anymore don't go international so basically i will say to those in charge of the health sector are you proud of yourself are you proud of your job i will also say to those in the um, internal security monitoring sector shipment Wherever that happens to fall, resources, um, importation, exportation, border security, are you all proud of yourselves? Because if you have been get a strict eye on this, I mean, recently you guys are on social media, you know, hear the audios that we've been, they fly around among certain individuals, them from England. Where allegedly they don't work now for go supply kush to young people then. And then 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 Sidona England, they make like for say, you know, they are mightier than thou and they are good and they are good people. But yet the way they finance themselves, if what was said in those videos, in those audios, from the person where they accuse and also the response from the person being accused because if you not do something you know go talk them where they respond to the person say eh -heh, you owe me this for this not also so if i go just by that it means that this person or these individuals knew what they were doing and definitely they are part of the problem in the society and if they are part of the problem in the society and you know these individuals, why have they not been reprimanded? But yet, this person, they go salon, fun, 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 fun. And so you wonder where they get the resources. Because sometimes I can wonder why I can see some people them. Some people them, it makes sense because kind of, you can kind of understand the work where they do or their affiliation and so therefore, it makes sense that they are traveling or frequency to Sierra Leone makes sense. But some of them, other people, they see that, you say, hmm, $4,000, $3,000. Make we calculate back and forth, okay, almost $4,000. You know, come to centers, you know, come to feed in this, that, 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 eight. But yet, you don't already go three ten. The year, not half it. Hmm. So sometimes we even have to question. Me and they do I'm, I'm not gonna like you now. Sometimes I sit back and I observe and in my head I'm like, how are you able to afford all of this? And yet you s and then I can say, okay, what's in this person they do in life? Waiting at them walk. 
And then when I calculate the work to the income, no, they are just. And then so, not to be prejudicial, I always say to myself, do they have, are they involved in extra businesses that maybe we're not aware about? So I dig a little bit more. And when answers are not forthcoming or the answers seem shady, I sit back and I say to myself, may God help us all. And that is it. So take what you may of this one. Like I say, we don't cross border. We are now international. Not that they will like. <laughs> we like to be recognized internationally. <laughs> We've been recognized internationally. How far does recognition would go? Only time would tell. Anyways, make we they go before. I want to talk about um, the NGC. I want to talk about the NGC. So now I all know say the NGC recently get um, some kind of meeting where in that meeting day, some of the members then decide say they married with them being grief for do between them and SLPP, they don't want that marriage they can. <laughs> they say they don't want that marriage they can, that the married not they produce, waiting them be expect for produce for them. So therefore, the married na one side no more the benefits, not the benefits two side. Some pandemic say no, then too hasty, that's time young force. By the way, this is what I'm drinking today, Starbucks, yo. Okay, I don't know what you're drinking. I'll sure say by now some people and will say, Matilda, not say what they drink. Now, this are the drink today. Oh. So, some people and will say, eh, eh, sorry. Some of the people and say, eh, when I wait for us, the married too young, things just begin, when I forget them. When I give small term, and then you go begin to see the enjoyment from this married also. Then some other one then say, no, 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 no. Term don't do so, you do so, you do so. Term don't fix clock. Term don't fix clock. Term don't fix clock. You do so, you make all man going away. <laughs> but you see, when I forget who that put you na, or who that bring you na kind side, and that Udu agree for enter into an unholy matrimony. An unholy matrimony. And if you don't enter into an unholy matrimony, you have to stay in it. You can't cut rope or cut or butt chain, just as you know. You knew when you were entering, you knew it was an unholy matrimony. So why now at this point, you want for butt chain? You want for cut group. Why? So apparently, while they were in this meeting, this neck meeting, while they were at this neck meeting, obviously because they may get two sides to the So someone is asking me, what do I think about the Sierra Leone government launches rehabilitation center for victims of drug abuse? And it's a brilliant idea. It is a brilliant step. It is a brilliant step. I hope so they get all of the equipment them, then get the professionals then lined up, then get the 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 the, the room for accommodate the capacity of because the capacity is going to be a lot for accommodate the capacity and that then go put them at the right regimen in balance for wash out all the toxins then at them body and that rehabilitate them properly and that's not left them halfway i hold i hope that it's a full wholesome 90 days plus treatment and it is not a one-week thing or a few days thing. 
right? Because rehabilitation, proper rehabilitation, at least, at least, at minimum, 90 days. For you for be fully, fully successful, at least two years follow up. And even after that, you still need to be followed up because once a drug addict is always a drug addict, it just for relapse is very easy. For relapse is very, very easy if you don't get that coaching, you don't get that support system. And make sure, say, you don't train them out for discipline and self and discipline their mind. So what do I think? I think it's a fantastic idea. However, uh, all of these things that I've mentioned, I would like to know that they are in place, that it's a wholesome operation. And it's not just a one day, two day thing. Okay, they don't, they don't detox now. Okay, okay, the seizures, they don't stop. The tremblings, they don't stop. The tremors, they don't stop. Make we send them go to us now. That is the difference of what I'm talking about. Yeah? So the person who asked me that question. Now make her go back to it and having the same. So while them in then at this meeting, yeah, so Kuskas happened between the two parties then. The two party them uh, uh, meaning that the 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 side will say, oh, make we give them, make we give small term and the term and the side will say no, term don't fit clock. Term don't fit clock. So then they led to kuskas, 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 and apparently um out of nowhere. Allegedly, because waiting the police then get for say it different from waiting the NGC members then say, then say out of nowhere, police bombard the place and absolutely become aggressive towards the one them where one passed the motion of make their remove themselves from the unholy matrimony. And obviously, it led to a shutdown of the meeting. The meeting not go on as, um, you know, they uh, it not proceed further because the place was shut down. The thing is that I don't know what you people were thinking. I Seriously, I don't know what in The one that we want left for, the one that we say, eh, 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 then for the, una, the two parties, I don't know what you people were thinking. Let us go back to history. What in history tell we? The inception of this whole thing. You followed one person. You believed in one agenda. You believed in one, the fallacy of one thing. Right? And I remember I said I did not talk about that day from the very onset of this, um, the formation of this, this party. In as much as I, I, you know, I been respect the individual, when I'm in then at the helm of the, of the party, and like I said, I'm pretty sure um, as a matter of age, I will still respect him and give him the full respect because obviously it's nah, big for me. Big for me, me not to in, in company mates, right? So in that respect, in that regard, I will give him that respect. But in terms of how in operation, the analogy of in operation don't unfold, um, I don't watch my eye. Yes. See, yes, one eye too. You know, like when you come and meet and kiss, you don't go. That's where I am, right? That's where I am. So, me, una no forget say uno all make the mistake of the fallacy of one, the power of one. You know, give so much authority, so much power to this one person that una, una, una fall into the fallacy of group think because with this one person, it bring una along into group think. And in that group think, somewhere wise enough to cut up right at the start and say, ah, nothing say this was so good work for me, or make a debauching. 
But there are those who follow to the very end. And if you follow to the very end and you agree, say, even though you knew clearly, 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 the writings were so clear on the wall that after this unholy alliance, when somebody they tell you now for say, you aspire in your own political ambition under the umbrella of a political party that you believed. If they tell you for say, make you stand down for somebody else, for be a winner, for run and take, take over. You know, say, they not say, okay, let there be a fair playing ground in this unholy alliance. You go, you go stand, you stand, make yourself good and good, and let the best man win. But instead, you were instructed to stand down and give road to the other person where they come, where they become bad fellow with. Hey, was that not a red sign, a red flag for you guys? Did that not say enough that? When the un only unholy alliance is, 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 is cemented for the person in your own personal agenda, he was going to butt chain with you people. He was going to cut ties and cut chain. But if you not tell me, say, when I know been believed saying that they go happen, when I know me know saying that they go happen before we all vote and agree to that, then I would be like, you have no business being in a political formation. You have no business being in a political formation because your, 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 your level of reasoning and analysis is not up to the standard of what, what is required for being at any kind of formation than they. A number was needed. A mass was needed. You were that number, you were that mass. That was your negotiating time. That was you, that's where you had your negotiating power. But instead, when I decide for give up on a negotiating power to serve the agenda of one, thinking that when the agenda of one wins, you will be brought along. Fat chance. Make I go to the caller. Caller, which is your name and who's you call from? Hello, viewers. This is now Omaru the call. Yes, uh, Omaru. Um, uh, to start with, um, NGC political party, now the most foolish political party Salundo ever gets. Now they get me? Yes, go ahead. I listen. Hello? Okay. Now the yes, most foolish ahead. political party Salundo ever gets. Normally, coalition una can go normally na in runoff in the bill of coalition or even mm -hmm. if you bill them before the runoff una don't get tangible reasons una don't get specific positions them una fix yeah. that una hold on to before exactly. ever una go into such coalitions so but for less some people um, where then say they are educated, we are cautionable for from the act, where they do we don't show say with some of the caution the education. We cannot forget about good doctor degree enough. I do use them for better yourself. Then they will put things in place where it is safeguard and protect them. They left vague, 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 vague agreement in the SPP and then they like today and then make a watch the one of the uh, uh, um, program in uh, 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 this um, v, um, AYV way, then they play the video way that man they can like say you want cry. The tea hurt me like I'll get right and I'll knock out say you don't. That's all I said, I'll pull full night. But anyway, that's not politics for Salo Lole fam. The lack can out to the issue, Matilda. You see, Matilda, you see that country when they get me. Eh? Yes, we they hear you. They Hello? Mm -hmm. You see that country? People will not like that country. Where they talk about people will not like that country. You know, number one, Matilda. <laughs> but you know, number one. But you, they see Salon, Salon go international. You know, celebrate enough who say you see, don't? <laughs> but we they not recognize you internationally. Oh, you God. see? 
But uh, the most serious part, you know, this, you know, that, that left the phone first. This, you know, really good for a nation, you know. As a youth, um, you see they do you not upon good thing or not upon bad thing. Um, everybody, every Australian way is they will say a day for now, at least, you know, if for they take this more serious, you know. But um, again, how for take this more serious? Now for make sure, say, create more job opportunity for young youths in that country. Why well, I say job opportunity, not to any kind of job, not to car wash you. Mm -hmm. Job opportunity, we said they go learn job where they engage themselves. Because what they do yeah. where you open car wash, where you to go wash motoka, you not get no skill now for wash motoka, where you don't wash motoka, you buy kush. Mm -hmm. But if you get job, you don't encourage and learn job, people don't learn job in that country, that carpenter, that messina. Did you mean any way you go take it away the fall on? You know, we're not gonna say that good stop people and for letting not drink or let not chuck or let not take kusho, but at least it go minimize consumption a little bit. We feel seen yeah. at that. Um, would encourage government where it is fed against kush, let them get mm. alternative. Let them get alternative. Then talk about apprenticeship, they talk about this. Let know we only be political and uh, political um, uh, 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 statement. Let them put that into practice. Let them make sure they engage the youth in Sierra Leone. And with the youths, with the youth, we self, we for ready for embrace change. But salon, any two can have salon a last stop. Any two can have salon a last stop. Youth, man, any two can have salon a last spot. Matilda, down to the, 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 the Facebook where people enjoy. TikTok where people enjoy a route to win a salon at Mameko Center. You see? So now most of them thing and we serve the youth who need the help to save. Things where people concentrate on or things where people take more serious, we need to take a more serious. Things where be for sending they kill we too be for sending destroy we now they will pay more attention. You see, so I think so we all for can this a national issue. This is not the political party and uh and I so happy. The way they discuss, I mean, no put up on party, no put up on politics. He talk um, in, in that general form. Let it know say this every Slavonia, whether it is under idea, everybody is involved. Warrior law gives moral support to the one the way they did. The one they did, let it for embrace change. And the government who aid in our power, let it for put policies in place where they engage youth man. Then. Thank you very much. Thank you very much um, for your contribution. Um yeah, well spoken, you know. Um, um, <laughs> you know, Umar is a, a master sarcasist. <laughs> you know, he's the master of sarcasm. <laughs> he said, <laughs> he said, I'm not like Salon. <laughs> Salon don't go international for gliding. <laughs> Salon go international for the wrong reason. So, anyways, I, I get his gift. I got what he was saying, you know, throw light on some of these things. Um, make it light-hearted even though it's not a light-hearted conversation to have and reality to face um i want to take one minute for acknowledge matakoma matakoma where they watch me from uh, youtube hey keep it up keep it up keep it up keep watching us uh, join the discussion but like i've been the same so this person remember then get an original agenda they're all, they even kind of make sure, and I, and I ask, quite frankly, and in position, I say, okay, if this current president or them give you a position to help, would you accept? Then the answer was no, because there is no possible position that he can give away, no, don't get already possible exposure you can get and when you don't get already and that the person gets one goal and one objective and that was you know to be at the helm of the political chain in Sierra Leone which is the presidency but I guess say uh, you know as time goes on in your life for say um the window they become smaller and smaller and smaller and so therefore, uh, 
take what you know you can you can make of what you have and basically that's what he did and you only were a party of this you know i see i see just men suma <laughs> i don't watch the full interview make an online i know for see me at the tell you the truth i saw like but but about less than 10 seconds 10 seconds i knew i um, automatically knew what was going on because i remember at a particular point time where i've been get some of the you know ex members them of ngc nami program and ask them what went wrong according to them how do they feel about this what's the way forward and why they their own their own value and conscience and moral not allow them for stay anymore is that Dr. Kande Yunkela and Jesmed were in South Africa at the time watching my show live and had something to say. They did not appreciate me bringing those people onto the show to speak their truth. They wanted me to run the, those people truth by them before a ERM. And so my response back to them was, Whenever I don't say I don't operate in that manner, that I they go cross check with you first and get an okay with you first before you can have me show. That I go tell you waiting at the discuss and me questions and before it not ever happen. Because it means I don't frame your mind, I don't set your mind for sex for set yourself up for look good. If you're able to answer me question, then right there and project, I know that you, you are thinking right on the spot and giving. And that's how I do my show. And so I said to them in rebuttal, in response, if we do not like waiting the people and they talk, and we do disagree with waiting and they say, we not for saying the platform always open. You are free to come and say your piece. I, stood, I said, you are free to come and say your piece. It is always open. Me, I know they discriminate. But they never took me up on that offer. Instead, just made me one for going back and forth. And then I said, listen, I don't do back and forth. You don't can at this show. You know what in the show is all about. You know that I am a straight shooter. I know they means me well. When you didn't have a show, I know get paddy. After the show, we can become friends. Before the show, we can be friends. But during the show, we are not friends. You will answer the question. And if you choose not to answer the question, you will tell the people I choose not to answer the question. But I'm not going to set you up and pump you. You know, for if I can't give the people there for drink, you know they happen. It not go happen. It will never happen. And so, to that extent, I say to Una, Una no for say, this married Una don't enter so. Now, like when you married person, when a Catholic person, eh? You know the divorce. You know the divorce. If you mistake go divorce, you go sit down at the bench, behind, behind, behind the bench, behind the church bench. You are not welcome among the congregation. You know they go sit down any side at the church, not the pew. The only side where you welcome for sit down at the church, not the back. Uh -huh. If for any valid reason, the best they can do for you within the Catholic church now for annul the married. And if they are not the married, if you married back, you know, say so you know they go take communion. So now know what that mean right now. It is see that you know, decide for take the back bench position. Or if you know, decide for and all this marriage, you know, for so you know, they face communion table. You people knew what you were getting into. Sometimes when I can claim we like saloon, we like saloon, we are love, 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 love. And that is why sometimes I ask you, what does that love look like? How have you exhibited that love? 
If you are called to the fore, how will you exhibit that love? What is the meaning of love to you? The man don't butch in. If someone is telling you that you say you get your numbers there, you don't work your calculation, you don't put your people in at the gun, but last minute, he enter into a matrimony and the person they tell you say you should stand down to allow the other person for run so that then go get all the numbers for go inside the decision making us and you think that is a valid ask and you agree with that and you work with it and now you want to say waiting when I left what's in Saffold, but make I read the, 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 the press release for those who have not seen the press release that the police put out in justification of their actions. So now, for say the police always get justification. Hmm? Always. When they always get justification. No, see, waiting and justify them with. So that is the police being for say to you. The police say press release Sierra Leone police wishes to inform the general public that it received a request from the National Secretary, Secretary and General of the National Grand Coalition alluding to holding their quarterly National Executive Committee meeting on Friday, 8th March 2024 at their party's headquarters, 14 Nimbana Street, Freetown at 10 a.m. prompt. The content of the letter clearly states that the party plans to decide on varying crucial issue that may lead to um, divided opinion and tensions among the party members. Further to that, the letter states that they had received information that certain party members and persons are planning to disrupt the meeting by using violence and therefore requested to requested the assistance of the police. Hmm. In reply um, here to the um, Sierra Leone police acknowledge receipt of their letter and convey approval um, of their request for security coverage for their proposed quarterly national executive committee um, neck meeting. As planned, the meeting conveyed at the Afro said venue and time whilst the Sierra Leone police maintained their presence. At the meeting, as, as the meeting progressed, physical and verbal confrontation confrontations ensued, which turned out to be disorderly and riotous. The police then had to intervene and peacefully disperse the opposing party. No arrests were made. So, uh, so they say they get tip off, say some of the members them. I remember when I remember them, and I sure say these people are paid members, so they have the right to voice their opinion. However, what they do not have the right to do is to be violent. Hmm? For OP, you must tell person word, it's not a problem. Anyway, in the part of the world where I live, it is not a problem. You can tell me any kind of way you want to tell me. But the moment you get physical, there is, a, there is a big issue there. You have crossed the line that, mm, mm, you know they be. Verbal abuse, it is what on dogs back over here. Even the president gets abused. Justin Trudeau, my prime minister, gets abused every day. The ministers under which I work, they get abused every day. 50 fat are left, right, and center. Now, what on our dogs back? You know, I mean anything to me. Public servants get abused every day. But turn a dog's back. But the one thing you cannot do, physical. When it gets physical, you have crossed the line. Unacceptable. So to those who became physical, unacceptable. You are paid member. You are members. You are paid members. You have the right to voice your opinion. But however, what you do not have the right to do is to become physical. So if you become, became physical, obviously, then go X sooner out. But what the police is saying and what we understood from people who were 
presently there are two different things. And you know, for say salon, there is A, there is B, there is this said, that said, and what truly happened. So in that light, make we left and so. In this case, I will just say John Pamina, I don't win a John in this. And you know, understand that parable there. Mm -hmm. Make we they go. So let us um, make with a go, make with a go, make with a go. I want to talk about something where um, this thing don't begin to happen. And by the way, I don't know how true this is. And uh, I know for say the viewers and listeners, and I always get on a, on a, um, on a yes them, not the ground, on a eyes them all over, you know. Is it true that allegedly, I'm saying allegedly because this is not confirmed news, but the rumor don't they go around, go around, but I would like to ask this open here. Is it true that members of the family of former president um, um, J, um, J.S. Momo are uh, in prison? Yeah, big one. I like, when I, when I confirm this for me because that would be interesting and I would like to know if, if it is true, the reason why um allegedly now that make i say allegedly because not confirmed news we don't hear a couple of quite a number of times that members of the family of um, the former president uh, joseph saido momo that some of um, the members of his family are in prison in prison for what um we don't know if this is true and if when i get new source of that please when I make we know um, let's let's dig in and see for what what crime have they committed? Why are they in prison? If they are again, remember this is not something that is confirmed, but it's been said often. And you know, salon where there is smoke, oh yeah, there is fire. Another troubling thing that's been happening recently, I don't watch this thing in silence, is that Agoyeri says so and so opposition and us the go ram sakam, so and so opposition us the go redam. So and so opposition owes then go do this. So and so opposition owes them. And, I'm, and I keep saying to myself, and the common the common theme is that the, there's a common theme here. The common theme is that then the boss na the owes no warrant of arrest, no warrant, um, you know, warrant of um, whatever. Nothing. They know they bring nothing with them. Nothing, nothing whatsoever. Then just the boss now, the people they host no more. Then ramsack, ramsack, ramsack. I don't know what they are looking for. They're, but this has been a consistent pattern. Go boss now, the people they host most of the time and say na net, na in the boss, na net or early morning, na in the boss, middle net or early morning, and say na in the boss. And then the pattern is that so German and army man and they go together. Not to just the policeman and they go search. You know, I've had, I have a warrant to search your house. They know they bring the warrant, or they know they show a warrant, say they get a warrant for search the person in house. No, they know they show warrant. But the funny thing is that now, now two sets of people and they appear, policeman and soldier man together. Now then they appear now they now the now the victims then because now they are they are clearly victims. Now then victims they are so the host. And so far. So far, the people that where this don't happen to, then they go there, such, 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 ramsack, 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 and then they leave. It no matter if somebody they ask them, and, and apply, they are very aggressive, very forceful. You cannot ask them questions. You cannot whatever. There is no form of reasoning with waiting, and they do. They no go answer you. They no. They will just ramsack, 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 and then. After a while, then stow away. Few minutes later, then stow away. And there has been no um, information as to why this is happening. There has been no update. The government no say nothing as to why this don't become a reoccurring pattern and why make na members of the opposition they host them na in this they happen to on a consistent basis sporadically on a consistent basis and so recently the leader of the opposition dr samura kamara write a i would say it's a letter it's a letter of appeal or cry cry of appeal i want to read what's in it right 
I want read waiting a right, and where I read waiting a right, I want read waiting at the response where it gets following waiting a right. So please bear with me. Remember the phone lines are open. You can call at any time, give your opinion, because with me, I say I reach in two hour mark. But till now, we are saying goodbye. Until next time. So make I go to um, Dr. Samura in waiting a right. Yeah. Um he say I want to express um I want to express deep concern and to draw the urgent urgent attention of both local and international communities to an alarming development in our political landscape especially at a time the people of Sierra Leone are clamoring for a speedy restoration of normalcy. He said, over the recent days, we have observed a disquieting pattern of a heavily harmed military and police personnel making unwarranted visits to the residents of key stakeholders associated with the APC party. He said these actions seemingly conducted under the guise of such mission lacks clear legal mandates and raise serious questions about the respect for rule of law and due process, and more so for keeping within the spirit of the ongoing international um okay i'll just wait for me clear is this was small for me okay yeah internationally mandated and supported cross-party dialogue process he go on to say the first of such incidents occurred on monday at the residence of honorable kemosise followed by a similar unwarranted intrusion at the home of a right uh, major alf um, retired sorry retired major alfred paulo conte i know of more because i know they equally searched the house of the deputy mayor as well that happened a few months ago and i know of another one that equally happened a few months ago so it they named them two there also because maybe they happen back to back succinctly but more don't happen not to them two there so no more don't happen make her go back to the letter um where was i um these uh, uh yeah you go these actions only constitute a direct affront to the privacy and safety of the individuals concerned, but also sets a dangerous precedent for the use of state power to intimidate political figures and stifle positive dissent. It is imperative that we collectively voice our concern and call for immediate cessation of these unjust actions. We urge local authorities to adhere to legal protocols and ensure that any search or investigation is carried out with proper judicial oversight. Furthermore, we appeal to international bodies and human rights organizations to monitor these developments closely and pressure government authorities to uphold democratic principles and human rights. In the spirit of transparency, accountability, and the safeguarding of our democratic values, we must all stand in solidarity against any form of undue harassment and intimidation of political stakeholders. It goes on to say, the path to a just and equitable society lies in the respect of the rule of law, due process, and the protection of all citizens' rights, irrespective of their political affiliation. So this was written on March 7th, which was on Thursday. Like I say, 
this was not new to me um i recently i think now one day ago i find out about the um retired paulo conte young situation like i say i know i know of the on 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 unjustified search way take place now the deputy mayor in os i know about some other few opposition people them where themselves get an unwarranted unjustified search obviously can also say when you up on it come online and talk about them um, and then now paulo conte as well let me just say if even you don't go search somebody in os you can't just burge into the person in os without a warrant without paper we should say i get the rights for the so and for such a course if even you think the person is guilty of something if even you think say you can descend on the person without notifying them because you feel say that gives them chance to hide something because so far all the search they wanna don't do una no una no pull don't do okay don't don't go so this begs the question why these sporadic searches in this in the in the you know now them people they are so they host. and even more so if you go do their search they are so which if you get a tip off or you are investigating something you have the right to search but with permission you know you forget your warrant for search with clear instruction and clear permission, say I get the right for doing I can do ya so for they so for doing I they do. But how you how you go barge into somebody in house most of the time in the middle of the night, sometimes in the early hours of the morning, and I think actually in the early hours of the morning now I can do that thing the so. In the early hours of the morning, some of these people have young kids. Some of these people have visitors in their home who are not exposed to this type of aggression, this type of, you know, unruly behavior by a, a, a force, you know, an authority figure, authority force that is supposed to, remember, say, una moto na for save lives and property. In a primary mandate, save lives and property for the police. To the army on a primary mandate now for defend the sovereignty. Defend the sovereignty, the other one save lives and property. So if una way on a primary role now for defend the sovereignty and save life and property, now una, now they can put fright and intimidation for the people they want are supposed to safeguard and save. How does it look? Truly though. How does it look? And I think what's even more troubling about this is that the chief minister in response to um, Dr. Samura in concern with erase, and not in other way, you know, talk inside that letter day that I would deem offensive um you know intimidating you know that um I, I find the letter for be a very reasonable letter a very reasonable ask a very logical he asks very logical questions at least if they can budge into somebody you'll get warrant at least follow the law of the land well over the law of the land you get you get twist but it exists and what it exists about we follow them like i say you cannot be speaking peace from one corner of your mouth and on the other corner of the mouth you the exact tyranny and you feel to say peace will prevail peace will abide that's not how it works you can't have your cake and eat it too you're going to have to, have to at some point decide if you would have a piece of that cake and what part of the cake you're going to have.
So, the chief minister in response to, to Dr. Samura in, 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 in concern, I find very, very interesting. For somebody to say they're not a tight committee, then they try for move towards peace, dialogue, cohesion. For somebody we got team up inside UN, they talk about the 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 God, the presence of um, Sierra Leone as a non-voting uh, member. For somebody we go sit down inside UN, they talk about what's going on in the Middle East. And the concerns raised, therefore, and the hopes and aspiration of what should be, I find in response very, I wouldn't say troubling. I don't know if, and I don't notice this, I don't notice this pattern from him. I don't know if he can intentionally try for pick at people by saying the wrong things so that it garner attention. I don't know if this is an intentional thing that is because I don't watch and repeatedly the way we can respond to other opposition members then when they talk about something very valid or there is very valid concerns he has a very dismissive and sarcastic way of addressing issues almost as if to say don't don't go come up here and what you do or what you they say waiting we do next quarter that's how it's coming off to me as i don't know if you don't observe that to me i just they say waiting me don't observe so this is what he had to say. His response was, I am sorry, sir. I think you've been misinformed. The police tells me they visited houses that have been confiscated to the state as per the completed COI for some ECOWAS state security activities. <laughs> oh my God. They aren't looking for opposition. Never have and never will. Thank you, sir. So basically, what in this man they say is that, what in Samura Kamala say is invalid. That Kemosi say in us, then confiscate them as COI. When did that happen? How did that happen? He said, then they, then they, for, for, for ECOWAS activities. Paulo Conte and Osu Saide. That is the case. I tell you, I say, I know of the, 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 the one from the, for the deputy mayor. That is also the case as well. So this, Chief Minister one convince the Sierra Leonean people then say, and if that is the case, why you not write letters to these occupants of these um, um, places and say you are an illegal occupant of this 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 state or this estate? It was confiscated or it has been confiscated as a result of the COI process. Letter to vacate. If not by so and so and so and so date, the house will um, be rendered, you know, um, not non-accessible to you because of state security use. But then people lay out they talk, so the host them way that they not to state host them, not to state host them. And if we go back and at the COI report, thank God we get them. Nowhere there is it written that 
Mr. Luke in Os, and they talk about the deputy mayor now, na state property. Kemosi say in Os, na been state property. Was Desmond Luke part of COI? Was he? Hey, bo, na me put the left then can't see so bo. You are a very young man. You are a very young man. You have so much ahead of you. Why would you allow yourself to be so power drunk that now you make light of people in life? You make light of people in experience. You disacknowledge people in experience. So their reality is no more a reality. It is a fiction of their imagination, according to you. Because basically that's what that's saying. Make her go to the caller. Caller, what's in your name? And who's you call for? Yes, sir. Um... I have I have a contribution to make, Matilda. Yes, please go ahead. You sir. see, we must stop for the discuss the problem and begin to offer solutions. And I think say it's time we begin to offer solutions where the government will don't become a terrorist institution for begin understand say. There are alternatives to their actions. A state is an institution built on trust. Mm -hmm. What the government is doing presently, they have diminished, and now the trust level in Sierra Leone don't go to the level of Usai. They don't begin to convert itself into terrorism, state-sponsored terrorism. The people of Sierra Leone deserves better. If these guys cannot run Sierra Leone, I think it's time we begin to ask them, let us consider how we can do partitioning of Sierra Leone. Let them then at their side and behave how then they behave so the other people then they outside they won't behave peacefully. Why am I saying this? Re look at what in the chief minister right. There is no logical connection between going to such a person's house and a confiscated property, and the third factor we come into the, the thing we write, com completed COI for some ECOA state security activities. What is the connection between ECOA state security activities? And why do will the Sierra Leone police and army go and conduct ECOA state security activities when we have an ECOA arrangement for an ECOA force to be in Sierra Leone? You see, let people then left for begin take for the take people there as if to say we not doing better, we stupid. Now, willful acts for create panic and get the opposition for back down on this trapatite committee negotiations where they're gone. They are doing it targeting specific people, but again on this side, are they blame the APC as a party? Some of these things. Now the internal wobbles and troubles they cause them. Then for begin to think out of the box and become a more united force. The, the, the state-sponsored activities is going on because they know there are frictions within the APC. Law go attack them, or law attack this, law attack that. Nothing no go come up behind that. The APC mm. has to bring to present a more united front. For make some of them to come under control. If we cannot get this under control, law begin ask the international community, law consider the partitioning of Sierra Leone. The old man in the area. Law get <laughs> We don't tell with this. Indeed. It's getting it's getting nauseating. It's getting tiring. It's getting draining. Really. Um, I don't know if um, we are still there on the line. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, thank you. You know, yes, I'll take the course. I'll take the course. It's really, really been done, round up, almost round up, most not, so I will take the next call. Um, call up. You say the call from. Okay. Hello, yeah. Kola. Good, good evening. Good evening, Math Matilda. Yes, good evening. 
you know, um, I listened to you two presentation where you do. I mean, when you read out Dr. Samura, you notice we pull out and the response we get. This is yeah. a pattern, like you rightly said. The, one of the reactions, the way the Chief Minister Bidongi were exactly full of sarcasm, nonchalantness, and disrespect for the country as a whole. Now, after the yeah. November 25 incident, when the yes. APC, let me ask a question about the prisoner's release. It's a uh -huh. letting go the thing. Yes, I remember the that. Prisoners them. That and one. then they will go to the dialogue table. Yes, I remember that. That now one. Then now, this is another one. Uh -huh. So, if actually the word we use then confiscates a property, it means say the states don't take a mover. Mm -hmm. I might be wrong, Mama. Do you correct me? Yes, a confiscation of a property means that it's been taken over by the state. Exactly. Firstly, with Jagaban, they did the same thing with Jagaban. Jagaban ever work in a government? Right, that's right. I the forget deputy, to mention the, that one. Yes, that's the true. deputy yes. mayor. I think it's quick quick risk. Yes, yes. You know, ever work in a government. Never. Mm -hmm. Right. Even Kemosi said the Osu side they so now. Not to the Osu now and they will be the under question for um the COI. The also be the under question yeah. for COI. Now be a property where we get na outside and do link on queer or something like that. Now that land mm -hmm. they be get issue for. Mm -hmm. Although of course, you know get issue with COI. So for let the chief minister come shamelessly mm -hmm. and foolishly, they make such comments. It worrying. And let me tell you what in my greatest fear. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Now for lay we picking the way they come up, then turn and look back, say, Mama, but you know make sense for man go school. Papa, you know make sense that go school. Because look the way a doctor from one of the most pre prestigious universities in the world. Now in the BF so whose message you they send to the young one the way they come up, say a good follow we get educated. A good follow we go college, a good follow we aspire for going to the best universities then in the world. Now, people like that, uh -huh. they believe so. But yeah. I'm not surprised from the world, this set of people are full of arrogance. They're full of arrogance. Imagine Kemosi say the possible lead the research in name Abu Mosi. I don't think say it work in awareness. And I don't think say it in any one of the four system, but yet still, a lead is such. Uh -huh. Just like with Mr. Jamboya see, intimidation, continuous intimidation. That's the tactics, that's the pattern we've seen over the past five and a half years. But until the opposition gather themselves, they decide to say, you know what, let we stand up against the common enemy. Let we stand up against the common tyrant. Then we'll continue for do that to them. Thank you very much, Mama. Thank you very much. Um, before I go on, um, I just want uh, my um, technical team um, to go on to our um, production um, production material page to look at to look look at some information that um, has just been shared. Thank you very much. And then now I can proceed. I'll go, I'll go on to the next call. Call out waiting on your name and you say the call from. Yeah. Hey, Mr. Cabo. I know it's an Indian, but you know the engineer or whatever, whatever. So I'm at least not concerned citizen they talk again. No, this is Matilda. Sorry, uh, do I look like Mr. Kagbo? My name is my name is Matilda. 
I don't say, Mr. I, I don't say you, I don't say now you the, the, what I call the program, but I know that in the background. Now that make I say, Mr. Kagbo, I don't say now you, Matilda, the, 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 uh, uh, how you call it, take up the program. Cause I don't list a okay. lot of things where they go on, but uh, I want to bring uh, some senses out of the nonsense where I go talk with some time I go listing. Okay, that's the world that's in transition at period right now. Just and give Africa me a second, I want to correct road. an assumption. I want to correct an assumption. I get a lot of engineers them at the background. Go ahead, go ahead. So I don't want to go ahead. You, make you misinterpret the fact that maybe you don't used to or you know about an engineer. Therefore, that's always the person. There are many engineers in the background. So go ahead. Used to, or you know about an engineer, therefore that's always the person. There are many engineers on the background. So, okay, I, I hope you don't listen to me. Say the world in a crossroad right now. I oh, know, sorry, the road, the, the world in a transition, and Africa within a crossroad. What thing they happen in Africa? So, nobody not go save any country because they. What till we they feel as alone so right now? It was threatening to happen in Nigeria or other country then. But because we know they cover the inside and they will just focus on salon. So le let me say this. I go fine for let me listen to the, the, the first and last speech of Gaddafi at the United Nations with Athena being the 64th assembling. If we get time for go listing that, that, because now 15 minutes is supposed for speak for, but I speak up to 45 minutes. If we go listening to that interview, then we go no wait in the apple right now because now I make them kill Gaddafi. If we listen to that and then we go no wait in the apple, nobody no get for safe saloon or nobody no get for safe Africa. Even the, the right man in our for they are so the channel program. Even if now you don't go put Matilda in a saloon, you know, go able to save saloon. Because we can do the system where you don't need to operate, you're not going to be able to change them. If you say you want to change them, they go check you out. So what do me they say? Coming to the country, right now, the man where they write now na angry na 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 like Chris Dog. Where all man they go not to any side good and they want please, please, them because please, you know please, so any side for, wait, anybody will attack at the bet. Yes, caller, I will ask you for be for choose your word them very carefully. I know things say I go sidom nayaso in as much as I not agree with the policy of the individual. Um, um, you know, I, I know things say I go sidom naya and allow you for you such disparaging language on 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 them as a human being. Please, so so no, please no. Okay, the man a madman. Na na the madman. Na madman. So the word na madman. I can use that. Um, I don't think that's acceptable either. But go ahead and make your point. No, well, I cut I cut off the call. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much. So, callers, um, you know, I know I can use a lot of um, adages them during my show. I can use a lot of proverbs them during my show. I can go deep inside a cool language and talk deep Creole talk them. But at no point I will insult or degrade or demean another human being with my choice of words then. And I think say we for be very, very careful about that. One of the issues and problem in our society today is that we have a problem of filtering. Do you beg? When we sit on Ayaso, Use any adage where you want for use in trying to communicate or put your point across. If you sabi deep talk like how me able to talk deep talk, talk inside talk, do am. But I beg, 
Prayer. Nor in at any point use any language with dehumanizing. I beg of you all. Thank you. I'll go to the caller. Caller, waiting on your name and who say the call from. Thank you so much, Mrs. Sister. The call from the U.S. Happy Women's Day. Um, I just. I'm not gonna make this long. I just want for um send this message to we brother, uh Chief Minister, baby Dr. Senge. Um David Senge, you for consider yourself one of the lucky ones and blessed one. Um you don't they reap the country in resources. Um it gets a very heavy weight. If People and they struggle and out of their resources, and they take care of you. Um, you always get for be careful how you they deal with them. In other words, how you for provide for them. I they say this because you get a long way to go. You get a long way for go. Um, so you really get for um, begin for think about the next twenty years. Oh. Which thing get for happen? If you know they in the same position where they today, you want to let the same thing where they happen to people and today, where they've been doing experience the same power, where we all been they say the same thing about how then they exact that power to other people and where they not get that power yet. Mm -hmm. You know, it gets for really be careful. Um, I know say you don't achieve a lot at the age where you did. Dr. Senge, but remember these three C way one old man be tell me. You see, for let you do well in life, then three C I you say you for be careful with them and say uh, capability, capacity, and character. Right. You know, today way they give you the opportunity for let you get a good job or you will let you get a good position. That now mm -hmm. capacity and capability is say go make you for mm -hmm. let you get good job good position I say but the one leg will go sustain you in that position and now your life na character right and when you get power it's easy for use that character day in an abusive way you get a long way for go mm -hmm. when the people and begin feel how you they respond to them you get for be careful mm -hmm where of waiting get for happen around you when you turn around and everybody we is supposed for cover you in no day again because mm. that they reflect from what you be do the ten way you be get the opportunity you know the response to the time wait and say hey then people yeah we the least be say for release wait then they respond to that as if now foreigners you they talk about. This is real union. Yeah, your brothers and sisters. Very young man. You get the capacity, you get the capability. Add good character to it for longevity and peace of mind. Thank you so much. Thank you very much, caller. I will go to the next caller and maybe take one more call. And then that will be the end of the calls for tonight. Um, let me go to the next caller. Okay, so we lost the caller. Um, we, if the caller come during the time where they talk, then I will take, oh, the caller is back. So let's go. Caller, what's your name? And who's the call from? Hello, uh, Matilda. This is Nauma Reden. Go ahead, please. Um, actually, sorry that they go out, out of topic a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I'm concerned the app. Okay, go ahead. Okay. Um, the the commercial part of the app, like uh, the 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 online uh, the online business for sorry my phone they give me problem 
That's okay. Classified. On Hello? Business. Did you get me now? Is it the classified? Okay. Um, are they, are they trying to talk about the online market? Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Sorry because I go out of topic, but I know say um the time when Mr. Kagbo can come on most of the time, you know, man okay you meet up for for listening to the program. So now make like uh, I've been just one make I've been just one ask if in the future of you know if VOS will be able to use that platform at least for provide not only we una way they and about two way in Europe for provide service to we that now one and again if VOS will be in the future at least you know Sierra Leone we not get the system like we Nigeria Uganda get for order something for um, Alibaba or AliExpress directly to Sierra Leone what are the chances if in case because I know go, I really I know they expect too much answer from you but what are mm -hmm. the chances or what are the services where viewers go render to we towards that part day in the future mm -hmm. for CC Sierra Leoneans able access more like uh, the one waiting at them part there where they build we will access mm -hmm. the service of China mm -hmm. through the app if it can possible in the future because um, for now we see and see now one of the things that we will lack in Sierra Leone Sierra Leone, one of the oh. African country where you need to order something from uh, from China directly to Sierra Leone if you not put money in a post in your hand. So oh. being that viewers they are in a very good platform, which in Nadi you help towards that side here. I know say I go out of topic, but now some two be done on my mind for long for acts. But uh, most of the time, like where Mr. Kago, the time we can count on then till they meet at midnight now. So your question that oh. and the service how the service will reach to in our europe but yeah thank you very much okay thank you very much and i will answer that question the way they talk about the app okay. thanks for the question I will address okay it. then thank you bye yeah so i they close the phone line if we not get any other caller on the line i close the phone line um and on the yes um so the phone lines are officially closed um on the topic, the last topic we I discuss, like I say, this guy is a very young man. We long term people then can say, take 10 kill and make you make you see in God. And I know say Ange na a very, very, very small, tiny, 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 um, you know. So for make you kill them and for make you see in court, you have to be very skillful. It means say you for take ten waka, you for sabi waka, and you for no how for waka. Because where the waka where you the waka, you go feel say na you they take yourself go usa you end up. But now how you work and how you know how for work and what in you work out. Now they take you go so you end up. For someone to have of that caliber to have raised the concern. In fact, I will forget about the Jagaban one because I tell you now for say I don't know a few incidents. He was one of the people that I knew about. I tell you about the deputy mayor, I knew about that one. This Jagaban was a person I kept forgetting. This um, Sierra Leonean American businessman, and I remember during the election, he, he poured in a lot of money. And then the other two, the Kemosi say now, um, Paolo Conte would not mention. Somebody they raised concern about something legitimate and instead you choose to sarcastically dismiss them with something that is not even relevant to what they are saying. And if they call you right now, say, can show proof, say, Mr. Lukin Os was confiscated by the COI. Would you, Mr. Chief Minister, 
If they call you that, because now you are them part of the world, yeah, so you lived in this part of the world, you were educated in this part of the world. Well, I mean, not fully, but partly. But education and education, a lived experience is a lived experience. You know how the system works. You know, say, if you make them kind of allegation, they then are then years so people go drag you for every penny you are worth because they know you cannot prove it. But because of the society, they also we come on, and I don't use forget away with all kind of nonchalant attitude. And so in this very critical Jagaban way they talk, you don't ever see Jagaban, see if in the part of COI. Paulo Conte, was he part of COI? Ebo. If you don't like somebody's self, if you hate somebody's self, there is a way you go about it to still respect their humanity, their humanness, their dignity for crying out loud. If now you, would you be happy to be treated in this manner just because you happen to be on the other side or on the other fence of things? Make we take turn at this wall, oh. Because the dunya is long. Make we take turn. Make we not allow power for influence we so much, for sedom inside, for takeover we so much, so that we lost with common sense. Our common thought process, capacity to reason, we lose it just because of small access, small power, small change. Not the last forever. Oh. We don't see them when they're waving. They up, 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 up. How them for them? Whoop. And we were in our corner observing. And we are still in our corner observing. So let us be careful. For the coma, I want to say thank you for watching. CB, I want to say thank you for watching. Albert Lansana, thank you for watching. All them people there, so they watch me from YouTube. Um, you know, obviously, Mohamed Kamala, Mohamed Jalo, y'all, thank you for watching. And every, everyone else where they watch me, I want to say, Boku Boku, thank you. Oh, now they watch me. But I'm just saying, let's deal slowly. Mo go dear, dear, big, suffer, suffer. This life, no way, I'm gonna judge you for taking. Do ya? Today, you have the upper hand. Things might change at any time. When you no longer have the upper hand, you want, you still want to be able to be invited at the table. You still want to be able to be welcome through the doors. So make it in such a way that you are you still have the opportunity to be invited at the table and to be welcomed through the doors. Yeah. You know, and put yourself in a situation where after all is said and done, you begin to watch your back. Because some people in the now in America and other countries that women don't commit some real tell up and some people in any side way then you go now and you watch them back. You don't want to be that person. I don't think it's a good feeling, honestly speaking. And you have you're a young man with a young family. A lot of life ahead of you. So not take your young and twelfteen for yourself, or take your more twelfteen for yourself. Yeah. To those who have been victim of this aggression, I say I'm really sorry about the fact that you are, you you conform. You have to confront these things but some of you you are part of the making of this nonsense because when I know me so I two day for tech I go to come in as much as I acknowledge your pain I go still say waiting you play part of some of you you are part of this nonsense because when you had the opportunity to change things to redress things to make things right for everyone you did not 
Instead, you kept feeding the beast, feeding the beast, feeding the beast. Now we don't turn to a big, big black pool for no now. And then with the masses that suffered in your hand, now they for turn around again and say, no, 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 no. We understand, but this cannot continue. So when you are giving space and you are giving a seat at the table, do right by everyone, including yourself. That way, posterity will allow you to enjoy. Posterity will allow you to enjoy. Some of the seed they want to sow now in the bedroom are so right now. As bad as it is, it's some of your oats that you sowed. You were part of the oat sowing. Some of you. So I cannot absorb Una from that. I can't absorb Una from that. It is the truth. <sighs> My gosh. Ah, salon, salon, man, salon. Ah, I love that country, but man, it gives me a headache. Make an online. But to another thing, when I know say we don't get the app, no? We don't get the app, we don't launch the app. Share massively. Most people, some people they don't download the app. We go encourage you for continue for download the app. If you get Android, you get the Android functionality for make you download. If you get um, Apple, you get the Apple functionality for make you download. Inside the app, there are different, you know, um functionalities them different setups them you know obviously you get the access to the radio you get the access to the show live broadcasting you get the network you get the light me i light you catch me i jam you you know instead of calling it the dating site you know, I mean, so i can talk right you get the group forum you know you get the um, the community. You get usa you can put your classify ad. You get usa you can do your business advertising advertisements. You get access to YouTube, Facebook, X, the internet to explore and all of these things. I want to go to the question where the caller asks. Yes, you can access the app from anywhere in the world. You can. There is space for everybody anywhere in the world. It talk about something like Alibaba, where I will refer to waiting. Most people then will call something like Amazon, right? Because most people are familiar with Amazon and Alibaba. I know for say we get um, contact with a company in China. However, we don't look that fight into waiting a proposal. I think it's a very good um, idea because VOS has created credibility and trust. People trust us. People know that we are credible. But for enter into those type of venture, you know, just the enter into those type of things. Just like we on our trust with credibility, we self get for make sure say. If we were to enter in such things, we vet the people them properly, that they are credible, they are not scammers, they, what they say they do, they do what they deliver, is what, what you order is what's going to be delivered and delivered on time. And you know, go forge alliance with somebody will not get a track record of consistency. So all that thing and they take heavy research, heavy investment, a lot of time, and for protect you, for protect us, and also for protect them, that thing where you need some form of you know legal agreement. And to go into legal the legalities of these things take time. So right now, I know for say the app is new. We are watching it. We're exploring it. We're listening to ideas and suggestions coming in, right? No means say now every idea we go take, but the ones that are most valuable, useful, and beneficial to all, definitely we go find way for implement. And I think say the idea where you bring them, the suggestion where you bring them, is a very 
um, useful and applicable one. It's a very useful and applicable one, but there is a lot of thought process that needs to go into it. Like when somebody say, ah, we would like a space to market our businesses in Sierra Leone. We jumped on that and we looked at it. We are like, yes, absolutely. Why make we not go create a space for people and we get different forms of businesses, hotel, restaurants, resorts, you know, bar, good bars and restaurants and you know things and where the diaspora then like and why yes and so we went in and people and don't subscribe they don't upload them business page there now the app so that is much more easier to do than setting up a structure like like you say alibaba or the amazon type of structure wherein you order goods and merchandise directly from the website and then you are assured it is delivered to your doorstep. Then they a little, a, a much more involving legality wise, uh, you know, mechanism wise, structure wise, then they will take some time. But don't lose hope. You know, for say, once you throw us a challenge and it is a challenge that is obviously beneficial or will be beneficial to all and sundry we will do our best to make it happen so now there go left that that question there and suggestion where you bring and but as to the accessibility of the app and every aspect of the app worldwide it is accessible worldwide um, that i can guarantee you so when i go when i go download 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 you get apple the one day the way they click on you download you get android the one day way they click on you download so please make good use of the app it is very very important yeah make we build a community make we build um you know make make we promote we own business system and that is why i said next week i want for make a contact viewers if you get a business you started from the ground up you're a woman Remember, I'm not talking to men this time. I'm not being discriminatory. We are in the month of the celebration of women, right? And um, there is a theme. And I want for make the woman then can sit down with me, some of the women, because I will not have space for everyone. But I will look at what you do. So when you de contact, make sure, say, if you get a, a website of what you did do, send them to me. Because I would want to take the time to read the background story of what you're about. I would want to understand what inspired you. And then from the Lord, I will choose few people that will come and sit with me next week. And we'll get a very good discussion. I'm really looking forward to that. I'm going to ask my technical team to keep their eyes and ears open for, um, you know, um these type of requests for next week saturday and we'll set it up and you know you get an opportunity to sit with me and 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 discuss and talk really talk about make people and get to know know you and know about you your business um this honestly it's a it's a it's an opportunity because i know they charge you now for them VOS is not charging you for it. You're not paying a dime it's uh, basically a free advertisement for you so make use of the opportunity um like they say make hair while sunshine so <laughs> you know make them um as i they um close and round up i don't want to forget anything um the kduso yes uh, kduso so the um clear descendant union southern ontario clear descendant union southern ontario on the 18th and uh, 19th of may then go get the 10 year celebration. Um, that's not the one, so <laughs> yes, then go get the 10 year celebration. Um, where then they get the dinner and dance party on the 18, and then Sunday the 19, then go go tell God thank you, where God don't keep them together for 10 years. So then they get for happen at Toronto, Ontario. You know, I am going to be live and direct, I am going to be there representing obviously my culture 
and um, you know being with um, my people and everyone else we will come for can celebrate with we um, from all over the place I will be there uh, you know to 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 appreciate the culture appreciate my heritage and and also give thanks and praise to God for um, the organization being in existence for, for, for 10 years and pray that God continue for, for cover the organization and, you know, cover everyone. Um, the other thing we I want to talk about is that um, I want to give a shout out to Mion Former Youth Fellowship Group. Mion Former Youth Fellowship Group. And I know where they can say, they can say some people then a few member. <laughs> I am laughing because of the ridiculousness of it all. <laughs> few mm. member. Well, I mean a few member. Eh? I mean say, gra from Grandaddy Tego, Ebenezer Circular Road. Yes, I mean a Ebenezer Circular Road Pekin. Ebenezer Methodist Church Circular Road Pekin. And uh, yes, I was once a member of um, the Youth Fellowship uh, um, you know, the Youth Fellowship uh, founded in 1974, 1974, and as a matter of fact, my father was the first president of the Youth Fellowship Organization. So you see me in a legacy picking. Mm -hmm. And had I stayed a bit longer in Sierra Leone, I should say myself before be a president of the organization, but I was a very active member, very, very active, um, mm -hmm. and you know, and what have you? So this Sunday tomorrow, then they celebrate the um, golden jubilee. Then they celebrate the golden jubilee, fifty years of the existence of Ebenezer Youth Fellowship Organization, Ebenezer Secular Road. So if you are free tongue, we listen as them. Where they free tongue, when are Christians, then please do well to attend and go back to me Youth Fellowship as then they celebrate the golden jubilee. I will not be there in person, but I'll be there with them in spirit absolutely i wish them all the best tomorrow in um you know in in the celebration um it's a very wonderful youth organization to belong to and i am a proud past member of that um, organization um you know youth organization so um happy anniversary beniza you know um youth fellowship organization as you celebrate your 50th so me fumble them i think say we don't reach who say we supposed for reach the show drag small but i think it was worth it for the things that i had to talk about and for the moments that we are in right now I be need for reiterate that point of the woman them. Um, with that said, I want to tell you now all boku boku. Thank you. We watch me from all over the world. We join in. We contribute. Had a word or two to say. Um, listen, we all cannot have the same opinion, but one thing we owe each other is to be decent towards one another and to acknowledge each other as human beings. May God bless you all. May God bless Mama Salon. Until we meet again next week, I can't wait to see who um, will be joining me next week uh, to talk about, um, you know, International um, Women's Day and uh, what it means to them to um, be inspired to inspire inclusion, what it means to them to inspire inclusion. Una thank you, thank you, may God bless we all and Una Tata.
They don't give that to you, then I will add. Innocent, you then me say, I will add. Picture leaders, then me say, I will add.